From the moment he set foot on an NBA court, Michael Jordan dominated his sport like few athletes ever had. He electrified crowds with his skill and style. He turned the Chicago Bulls into a dynasty with six championships in eight years. And in 15 seasons with the Bulls and Wizards, he would transcend the game of basketball, becoming one of the most recognizable athletes in the world. Not bad for a player who was once cut from his high school team. But that didn't stop Michael. In fact, nothing ever did. And after soaring to the top of the NBA, there was never a doubt that Air Jordan would one day land in the Basketball Hall of Fame. It's easy to understand why many consider Michael Jordan the greatest player in basketball history. But describing what made him so great isn't so simple. You know, I have the greatest respect for Michael because he put his heart and soul on the court every night. You know, just watching him dribble up that court and looking you right in the eye and not knowing what he's going to do is the scariest thing you'll ever want to be involved in. He just made you wish that for one day that you could fly in the air. You wonder what it would be like. Biggest shot in North Carolina history for a first-year guy to come up and be that willing to take that shot and to make it really just boosted him on to the career that he had. Michael would become a two-time college player of the year, and his high-flying exploits dazzled fans across the country. As soon as I got in the dressing room, Michael comes running in and grabs, Coach, Coach. And I said, what? Well, yeah, what, you okay? He said, I hope that dunk wasn't too flashy. I said, what dunk? He said, the one I just did at the end. I told him, let's don't you know, embarrass people with that. Drafted by the Bulls with the third overall pick in 1984, he was an instant sensation. First day of practice, uh, one of our assistants called me after the practice and said, I don't think you screwed the draft up this year. Michael Jordan is sort of the hip hop version of Dr. J. He come in, he, he, he's walking the air, he flies sideways, and the tongue out. Look at the air, look at the hang time, look at the flying motion. Every year he came back and he was better. He was stronger, he was quicker, he shot the ball better, he added three point. I guess the last thing image I would have of Michael is his smile and his total dominance at both ends of the floor. When you start thinking about all that he did, to me he's the greatest player to ever play. Winning is hard to do and uh, it's, it's a price that you pay for it and that's how I saw Michael as, as a player, as somebody that wanted to prove that he's a winner every day. My final memory of Michael is following through on that shot and making a great extension. That moment when you knew the shot was going in and just that look when he turned around and came back towards the bench and his, his teammates went over to him and they were coming back as a group. That's the uh, memory that sticks with me the most.